General Maverick reporting for the RSSF. Here is a short tutorial on how to set up OSA's hands-on stick and stick for Armor Core 6. So what I use is a small software called AntiMicroX. I found it through Reddit a few months ago when I was trying to use my joysticks uh, to play Freelancer, which is a very old game, which I used to love. And uh, yeah, this software works perfectly like uh there is no delays there is uh it doesn't use much C it doesn't use yeah much cpu it doesn't use much ram it's a tiny program uh the it has a portable version even uh, of 16 megabytes there is the installer which i use uh it's 13 megabytes make sure you run it as administrator when you run it whenever you run it mm. and then uh once you install it you click on run uh, you open the program and there are better tutorials than this one for how to use this program i'm sure you can find them on youtube uh, but the program is very straightforward uh, there is uh, both your my joysticks whatever controllers you have uh, set up uh, you have plugged it will show up here i've had the, even my xbox controller uh, plugged to my computer and it shows here as well and and then on the next one is your the profiles you can have multiple prof profiles uh, loaded you can save your profiles uh, you can save as load remove and then whenever in your joystick you move any any axis or you push any button it tells you which button you're you're pushing or you're moving right uh, and then once you do that you can you can set uh, whatever you want on it so for example for uh, armor core i took a screenshot of all the key bindings from the game uh, in the game menus you, you can find this in the game menus of uh, inside the settings of the game and uh, yeah you just uh, you just set whatever you want as you as you wish so for example for forward and backwards uh, this is the axis i should use you click on it and i need w and s or forwards and backwards and you just click here and you can set up uh, W and S or you can you can leave it as none and then here you can set up whatever you want here it shows a keyboard for you even it has mouse you can do wheel up wheel down wheel left wheel right uh, left button middle button and all those things you can have up down left right and it even has extra buttons there it has advanced options this software is is massive it has a lot of options it's actually overwhelming a little bit you can you can set many things on it so i'm going to set up w and s again because that's what i what i use i'm not going to save anything because i already have it saved just in case i mess something and yeah uh i don't know why it shows half of the software in english and then uh oh because my keyboard is set in spanish i guess that's why it shows in spanish but yeah that's how you set up everything it even has controller mapping i did try this one for armor core and it didn't work i still don't know how this works exactly but uh yeah uh once you have this set up uh just make sure that you go to your game settings on steam and uh turn off the controller you're going to controller and you disable steam input for your controller that's all i did and it works perfectly well you can then uh, tweak anything you want as you play like i used to have the game on and uh in the testing arena i think it is and uh you just alt tap on the game and you set whatever you want to tweak like maybe you want uh, your trigger to not be on this button you want it to be on another button uh you want it to be on maybe this button you want your trigger and that one you want it to be your you can change it easily very easy anyways i'm rambling so i think that's it i covered everything uh if i missed something uh, please let me know in the comments i hope you enjoyed it uh thank you very much for watching talk to you in the next one general maverick out